Right now, on Two Cock Sport Fishing TV, Captain Jack is preparing for a special day out on the water with the other cock, his best friend Ben Daughtry and Ben's two sons. Bye -bye, Daddy. As the owner of Aquarium Encounters, Ben is often tasked with catching certain fish for the aquarium, and the guys are after a nice Florida permit. We have to get this permit today for sure. With Captain Jack's expertise in surrounding waters, he's confident he'll be able to get Ben and his boys on a great permit. Got him, got him, all right, hooked up. But if Florida is known for one thing, it's thunderstorms. And it might just mean an early end of the trip if the guys can't get this fish in the boat on time. You never know what's gonna happen. It's not just a guaranteed catch. My name is Captain Jack Carlson. This is my tackle shop. And this is my fleet of yellow fins that make up two conch sport fishing charters here in Marathon, Florida Keys. I work here with my son Austin, who runs the 39. Crazy Captain Mike Macko, who runs the 34. And Captain Cam on the 26. My wife even has her own store right down the street. And the one thing I've learned after doing this for 22 years is you never know what's gonna happen next. Look at them swim around, they're beautiful. This segment is brought to you by Beach Marine Products. No pills for you. Oh, a lot of meat. Oh yeah, big baits too. The world's finest bait pen systems. A common question that Jack gets time and time again is, why two conks? What's the significance of the name? And like many other people, the story begins with a longtime best friend. Two Kongs is named after me and my best friend, Ben, who's one of the owners there at Aquarium Encounters. When you're born in the Keys, you're called a conch. So we bought our first boat back when we were about 18 years old, and I named it after us. It's a little damp, but I'm feeling great. It's gonna be calm out there, and I think the permit are gonna be biting. I'm ready. Permit's not an easy fish to catch. You know, they're hard fighting, the conditions vary as well, but once you hook that fish, you never know what's gonna happen. It's not just a guaranteed catch. Yeah, we're gonna sneak out here and see what we can get done before uh, before it gets too late, you know? And um, we don't need much time as long as the fish are doing what they're supposed to do. Jack and JC, uh, they do this every day, they're pros. So we're gonna we're gonna get it done. But uh, man, we're excited to get on the on the new boat, right boys? Yeah! Yeah. Well it's been a long time since I got to go out with Ben and his family. Never had a chance to fish with his kids yet. So I got my kid JC with his two boys. I'm really excited about today's trip and see them catch their first permit and give it to the aquarium. So our goal is to go out today and we're gonna hopefully get a kind of a nice mid-sized permit for uh, the aquarium. So hopefully we'll get a, a shot and maybe we'll get a, several shots at it and uh, pick up a couple of permit for fun and certainly at least get one for the aquarium because one of the iconic species in the Florida Keys is the permit. Lots of people do that for sports fishing. That's one thing that we're missing in the aquarium. We do have a bad rainstorm coming in. It's down off Key West heading this way. So we have to get out quick, get what we need, and get back to the dock before this nasty storm comes and gets us. So we have the new Furuno. It's the touch screen. You know, the views on it's phenomenal. It's on satellite view. You can also go 3D view. So you actually see what you're driving into. The new Furuno gear is top notch. We got radar, sonar, side scan. This boat is equipped with anything you would ever need to catch any fish out there from the flats to offshore. The new 26 Yellowfin, Ben and I are partners in it. So we're rekindling the two conks. We're back at it. I can't be more excited to add this boat to our fleet. And me and Ben in our partnership with Aquarium Encounters and two conks, it doesn't get any better than that. Well, we haven't actually been out fishing uh, really since before the storm. So it's been about eight months or more since we've actually had a chance to get out. You know, with, with Irma, we had to get the business back together. We had to get uh, the house back together. My yard's still not together, but uh, you know what? Some things have to wait. <laughs> You got some pill cheese? Yes, sir. All right, I'd like to, like to purchase a scoop from you. Right. Business got to be a little slow today, right? Really slow. Yeah, well, people know that what's coming, coming. Yeah. Thank you, Lucas. 
What are you guys going for? Oh, we're gonna go catch a permit for the aquarium today. But I figured, you know, we'd like to get some baits in case we see a sailfish or whatever else happens, you know? Yeah. All right, guys. All right, man. Thank, Thank you. Good you got it. Yeah, it definitely saves us some time here getting bait. A lot of times we throw the net a lot ourselves, but this is crunch time. We gotta get some permit. Once we get that, then maybe, you know, we may do a little fun fishing as long as the storm doesn't come in right on top of us. This segment was brought to you by Mercury Marine. Mercury Marine, go boldly. Ready for the fishing adventure of a lifetime? Then join Captain Jack and the crew at TwoConksGear.com. Go to TwoConksGear.com and get the swag. Get the apparel. Get yourself booked to go fishing in the Florida Keys with your favorite Two Conks captain. And just maybe, get yourself on an upcoming episode of Two Conks Sport Fishing TV. Get it all and book the fishing adventure of a lifetime at TwoConksGear.com. TwoConksGear.com. This segment is brought to you by Mustad. Oh, monster. All right, nice fish. Captain Jack and his longtime best friend, Ben Daughtry, are headed out in the water in search of a nice Florida permit for the aquarium. However, they're running against Mother Nature's clock. This technology can be game changing. I'll be able to see the permit, whether they're on the left side of me or on the right side of me. So it'll definitely help me out doing this. It's like phenomenal. Playing a video game, buddy. Look at that it thing. It's amazing. I want to play. I wanna I wanna play. play. <laughs> Come on in. Let's we play. We are. We're going to play. We're going to play. play Catch the Fish. Now, now who brought the controller? Uh -oh. We need the Furuno controller. That was JC's job, I think. That's right. <laughs> that looks awesome. Captain Jack's going to teach you how to rig for a permit. All right? Are you ready, bud? This is what I'm going to do here. I'm going to tie a spider hitch on this braid. Wrap it around one, two, three, four, five. And we're gonna take this tag in and we're gonna go away from us, just like that. And it's nice and easy. Take a wrap here and a wrap here. And then we're gonna tie our mustad jig, pull it tight, and there you go. We're gonna trim that. A lot of knots to learn to be a good fisherman. That's huh, it. Yes. We're ready for the crab. Put it right from under the top, the bottom side, all the way up to the top, and just wiggle it all the way through, all the way through, and it'll just sit like that. Look at that. Hey, now, 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 where's Alania and uh, Lanaya? Where are the girls at? Where the girls at? I don't know. Now, now, is Lanaya your girlfriend? No. No. I do not have a girlfriend. Are you sure? Because she says she's going to go to Case's school next year. She's really excited about that. That's right. I think she wants to be your girlfriend. No. No. Why not? Her girl's kind of yucky still. Yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> check. Okay, guys, cast out. Marked a few fish right there, but I don't check this weather. Look at that. Coming in heavy. Hold me to um bail open and let the line go out, but when it goes really hard, I have to reel it. Flip the bail and reel it. We gotta let that crab drift all the way to the bottom, son. He won't go to the bottom, but he's gotta drift out, basically. You know, we maybe have an hour's worth of fishing, so we gotta make this happen, and these permit need to cooperate, so we're not stuck out here in this thing, for sure. I do not wanna get caught in this storm. This one is a serious one. If it starts, you know, really coming down hard and the wind picks up, and especially if there's any thunder or lightning in it, we definitely got to call it, so. I'm booked fishing every day. I do not have time to come back and do this. We have to get this permit today, for sure. Permit bite's been slow all day. Just got to keep working it, find them, get these baits to them, get them down to them. So with these conditions, overcast, a lot of times I like to be in the tower looking for them. But Without the sun, makes them really hard to find, so I gotta mark them on my Furuno. 
Come on, permit, gotta cooperate. Speaking of permits, gotta have a permit to do what we're doing, actually, for public display, and that's where Ben at Dynasty Marine and the Aquarium come into play. It's really great uh, to work with the state and be able to show some of these amazing fish that uh, we want to make sure are around for all of our uh, residents. Cast out. Go, go. Go. JC, hurry up. That's them right there. We're marking them good here, man. These fish just have to cooperate and bite. Got him. Got him. All right. Hooked up. Good job, JC. Stay on him, buddy. I guess being late paid off for him. <laughs> Ready for the fishing adventure of a lifetime? Then join Captain Jack and the crew at TwoConksGear.com. Go to TwoConksGear.com and get the swag, get the apparel, get yourself booked to go fishing in the Florida Keys with your favorite Two Conks captain, and just maybe get yourself on an upcoming episode of Two Conks Sport Fishing TV. Get it all and book the fishing adventure of a lifetime at TwoConksGear.com. TwoConksGear.com. Two Conks Sport Fishing TV is brought to you by Mercury Marine. Go boldly. Must add. Furuno Marine Electronics. Demand the best. Onboard Bandit. Always wear protection. And Beach Marine Products. The world's finest bait pen systems. This segment is brought to you by Onboard Bandit. Onboard Bandit, always wear protection. Captain Jack's son, JC, just had his line go tight, and this could be the one. Got him, got him, all right, hooked up. Good job, JC. Stay on him, buddy. I guess being late paid off for him. <laughs> Get him, buddy. I'm not sure if I have you or a fish. God, it feels so weird. Sure don't want to put any pressure no, on No, I sure don't, because I don't want to pop this fish off. This one is going to the aquarium. I'm going to start setting up the live well. I think I'm wrapped up. You go, you go. Let me set this thing up. Let me turn on the live well here. Please. Feel like a permit, JC? Oh, yeah, fight just like a permit. Feel like a permit, eight like a permit. Here's hey, the fish yeah, I gotta too. get this slide up on our awesome. color. Slide up, JC. I gotta Big cut this okay. off. Okay. You got the net, Ben? Yeah, I'm coming with you. I'll cut this jig. Ah. Nice and easy. Keep it connected there, JC. You're doing great. Okay. All right. Clear. Case, come over here. I'm gonna let you handle them in. This is your fish. Oh, no. Put <laughs> the pressure on me, huh? Oh, that's the perfect one right there, buddy. Perfect. Stay connected. Real nice careful, easy, JC. Like. <laughs> Real careful, like. Hold it down, hold it down. We're gonna grab his tail, it's the main thing. That's big old one. All right, nice. Got him. That's what we came here for, boys, right there. Awesome nice. job, JC. Nice. That's Pretty work, JC. Let's get him in the well. And guys, we gotta get back now. We got this storm coming. We got what we needed. Let's get it in right now. Okay, guys, reel them up. Yep. Okay, yep. You ready? Hang on. Hang on, JC. Hang on. Do it, buddy. Okay. We gotta ride. All right. Okay, we got our fish. That rain is coming in right now. We gotta get going. Time is of the essence right now. Woo! She's got some kick to it. Yep, she's kicking. We should have Bucky sitting there waiting for us with a well with oxygen and perfect good water. So we're gonna unload this fish uh, right into a hundred gallon well on the back of a uh, company truck. And we're going to take it right over to the dynasty and we're going to put it in its acclimation tank. 
So one of the things that's really important is that we don't interrupt the slime coat on these guys. So as little handling as possible, no nets. You'll notice we grabbed them and reached in, into the water and put them into the well. Now we're gonna put them in a plastic bag so that once again, we don't disrupt that slime coat. Okay, ready? Here you go. Stand right there. So this is a big fish. So the key is getting a lot of fish and not a lot of water on them. Hey, JC, you caught too big of a fish, man. Hey. <laughs> Oh, he picked up the big crabs. That's right. I saw it. I was like, man, that all day long. Jeez. Big bait, big fish. Big. I, JC loaded the boat. I'm like, JC, little crabs, little fish. Everything about safety, right? Triple F safety. There we go. Okay, JC. All right. Got the nice job, JC. So, JC, we put the fervent in as well. Uh, we've got pure oxygen going through these lines, dissolving, dissolving the oxygen to help minimize the stress. As you know, he was in the live well, and you guys had fresh water going on him. But now that we've got no more water to turn over, now we need to have some oxygen in there so that he's able to breathe real well. We'll get him over there as quick as possible, and uh, this oxygen will allow him to live for about an hour in this tank, but we don't want to push it too much, so get him over there. All right, Bucky, Jack, you guys ready? We're ready. We're going to move this fish, put him into his uh, acclimation quarantine tank where he's going to spend the next month. We'll get him all treated up and ready to go. Here we go. He's looking strong right now. He's looking great. Nice, healthy fish. Oh, yeah, beautiful, beautiful fish. Oh, man, these permit are fantastic, man. They're hard fighters, definitely a trophy fish. I can't wait to see this one on display. Matter of fact, we pull up and JC says, wow, they have this? I've never even been here. Can you imagine that? I'm like, <laughs> what? Never been yeah, here. JC's never been here. Go, Bucky, I couldn't go. believe it. Go do it, Bucky. It's been a heck of a day. We got our fish. He's here at Dynasty. He's in his acclimation and quarantine tank. He's gonna spend the next five or six weeks here. We're gonna make sure that he's all clean. There's no parasites on him or anything. And then we're gonna take him right over to the aquarium and release him where he's gonna complete our collection over there. So far, so good, but we got a long way to go before he gets into the tank. Ready for the fishing adventure of a lifetime? Then join Captain Jack and the crew at twoconksgear.com. Go to twoconksgear.com and get the swag, get the apparel, get yourself booked to go fishing in the Florida Keys with your favorite Two Conks captain, and just maybe, Get yourself on an upcoming episode of Two Conk Sport Fishing TV. Get it all and book the fishing adventure of a lifetime at twoconksgear.com. Twoconksgear.com. Closed captioning is brought to you by Furuno Marine Electronics. We may have birds up here. All these little marks are gonna be birds. We got two birds working here. We, oh, nice dolphin, nice dolphin. All right, got him. Furuno Marine Electronics, demand the best. Captain Jack and his family, as well as Ben and his two sons, returned to Dynasty Marine six weeks later to complete the process of getting the permit to the aquarium. All right, JC, six weeks later, your permit's here. Way to jump. All right. Look at this crew. Nice, hey, man. Jack. Hey, good to see you again. Today's a big day, man. Yeah, yeah. You ready? Now, how's the permit holding up? It's looking fantastic. It really looks good. It's done a nice job acclimating. Eating uh, good every day. Eating healthy. good, gone through quarantine. It's going to look awesome in this tank, awesome, man. I'm man. excited about it. Nice, man. So we got to be real cautious. Get them out of here, get them into the truck take them on over to the aquarium. I'm game. Put me in, coach. All right, let's do it. Grab a net. Let's do it. Jack, you and I are going to work this net. We're going to work it together, OK, and try and get the fish in there. And as soon as we get it, we're going to hand it to JC. Young guy's got to run, you know what I mean? So we'll have him run and hand it right over to Bucky, put it in the, in the truck, and away we go to the aquarium. All right, hey, you caught it once. Don't lose it this time, OK? <laughs> we want a clean run. All right, here we go. All right, JC, let's go. Let's go, JC. 
Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Coming in, Bucky. Coming in hot. Coming in. All right. Nice. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Well done. Nice. Easy transition there. Very easy on the fish. That was great. Good job, JC. Good job, Bucky. All right, I'm ready. Let's go to the aquarium. All right, let's go. Precious cargo. Precious cargo. Jack, we can't put her in a predator reef tank. <laughs> no, no. No, she goes, she goes in, in the baby, in the baby reef tank. Say, so what's up, Uncle Benny? What's up? How you doing? What's up? Aw, awesome. Well, all right, you ready? Let's do it, man. Let's put this thing in. Uh, this is what it's all about. Multiple generations of conks. Today's the day. Yep, that's let's, it. Let's get her done. Okay, let's put all this right. beautiful fish in the tank. So why don't you okay. guys go on up and uh, Sounds good. get get up there, and, and that way you can you see us put them her? in. And then just in case they need a hand, there you yeah, go. Yeah, it's always good to have an extra set you of hands. If you need an extra hand, let me know. But this is your deal. This is you got. This is your profession that I don't know much about. I'm gonna let you guys handle most of it. But I'll he, I'll be a hand if you need it. You catch them every day, right? And we we put them into aquariums every day. And keep them alive every That's day. That's it. That's it. Here we How go. About I hold the door for you. <laughs> You make a great doorman, buddy. That's right. Ugh. Just don't forget the tip. <laughs> All right, Bucky, let's go check it out. <laughs> let's check it out, Manaya. Nice. There she is. Permit's going to get acclimated. JC, how's your fish look? Looks great. Looks perfect in there, right? Man, look at that thing. Oh man, it's already ready to be let out. It looks it's like, like it, doesn't it? Let He's me looking, out, let me out. For his way out. All right, guys. Well, we're here to release a permit. They stayed overnight in their acc acclimation tank, in the Predator Reef tank. Now we got to release them. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Let's send him in his happy home. Ready? Oh, you're going to help lift it up, Case. Good job. Away he goes. Okay, hop out of the way, boys. Back up, Case. <sighs> Tank comes out. You guys ready to go look at him? You, let's go look at him through the big windows. What do you think? Because look, look for the fish. Look for the permit that we put in there. Do you see him? That big one. Right over there, huh? It's just what the aquarium needed, don't you think, Kai? Yeah. It's going right oh. towards us right there. Yeah. All right, guys. Good work. Way to be out there. Peace. All right. That was yeah, a lot of work, right? 